hello guys welcome back to the channel crypto global 100 and this is the price prediction video of beta finance beta finance which was recently launched on the binance as on the launch pad uh, you know so this is one of the gems on the uh, beta uh, you know on the binance so over the last 24 hours we saw that the price and the volume increased uh, increased tremendously here you can see the volume has increased uh, at least 177 percent increase in the volume of the last 24 hours and if we take a look at the this is the chart and this is a four hour chart guys okay and these shc means the swing high candles okay these swing high candles are very important areas and swing low candles okay swing high swing low breakout candles these are extremely important candles okay i forget to mention the breakout candles but here if i mention this candle this one okay it is a breakout candle okay breakout candle so breakout candle is also very important so you have to keep an eye on three different types of candles swing high candles swing low candles and the breakout candles you can you know analyze the price with the help of these three candles just by looking at you know looking into the charts you can easily understand now you might be wondering this was the breakout okay uh, it break out from this area if i draw the level here okay this one 2.30 okay this was the resistance here okay and uh, this green candle it break out okay and the next candle retested made the swing high at 2.8 now this was a resistance here you can previously saw that it has been tested twice on the swing high candles so you see um, you know swing high candles are very important now now we see these two red candles if i you know just remove this one for now you can see this uh, you know these two red candles have long wicks on the upside it means that a lot of sellers are trying to sell they are booking their profit okay so and it is also retesting this level i told you several times that whenever a certain level is broken like here it broken because it you know uh, broke the previous swing high candle if i also mention this candle to be the swing high candle okay this is also a swing high candle and you can see that this was the barrier this was basically a barrier previously one two two times three times this was tested and then the price went up and there was a gap because it had to re you know it had to retest this level this is uh, this acted like a pullback so for now if i show you this one okay 2.3 would be our first support okay this would be our first support and if it gets rejected from 2.302 again repeating 2.302 if we see this candle get tested and um, you know get rejected from gets rejected from 2.30288 or the area around here then it and with a strong volume strong volume is also very important let us take a look at the obv as well you can see the obv chart okay you can see it tried to break the level if i you know draw a level here these two peaks they, these two peaks they are very similar let's try to find out the candles in here one this candle and second this one okay same volume okay if i draw the level here one and two now you can clearly see if we see the corresponding candles at uh, same at this area one and this one okay i'm going to talk about this one you see the price has tested the same level almost the same level okay with the same amount of volume okay so the this volume is going down if i draw obv from the downside yeah this one now if it stays above this uh, you know obv chart makes the swing high you know if we see anything like you know a strong volume on the up then that would be 
you know a convergence like because obv would then be making higher low okay but right now you can see the chart and the beta finance these candles are testing this level so surely gonna hit this level but if it you know breaks the level of 2.3 then surely we're gonna test at 2.09 or the area maybe maybe let me draw another level here swing low candle okay this is a swing low candle just let me show you last one okay swing low candle so this is basically a demand zone for now okay demand zone is this one 2.26 to 2.30 so we might gonna see a wick towards this area okay and then um, we might gonna see some consolidation and then the move on the up but if the candle fails to stay above these two areas okay i'm talking about these two okay not i'm not talking about anything else if this candle stays or gets rejected within this range okay then that would be a good uh, you know buying pressure otherwise if we see if we see anything closing below then we might be we might gonna see zero uh, 2.09 salmon level being tested and if we saw huge vo selling volume it can also break further and according to the fibonacci level guys according to the fibonacci level then we might be retesting somewhere here the price surely is gonna retest somewhere here around 1.8 okay according to the maybe we're gonna hit the two level as well okay but that is possible if we see this level being broken the second you know being broken and then the third one would be to make the uh, you know new bottom so right now uh, what is going on huge selling is going on okay after the breakout huge selling going on 2.32 2.22 okay you can place your buy orders around here or around 2.09 for now so this is the short term price analysis and if i show you if i break down the structure you can see on the day of listing price went up then we saw uh, some sort of pullback then a huge uh, you know re second time it tested here and then we saw a slow uh, you know distribution or sell off phase you can see then uh, ranging phase then again we saw distribution again selling okay again it it is in the ranging phase so you can clearly see there is a pattern going on okay some sort of uh, you know ranging then sell off then a range then again a sell off then again range okay and now we are in the phase of again the range and after the range we usually see the breakout now what we're gonna see we might gonna consolidate here and if we see if we see the candles holding this level with a strong volume then uh, in coming days we might gonna break the level on the upside so take profit uh, the lastly the sport one is that this would be the first sport this would be the second sport take profit would be 2.6 2.4 okay so this is the current analysis of the beta finance so thanks for watching guys take care bye